Hello everyone, uh, very good afternoon and welcome to this live session regarding monthly current affairs for the month of November 2018. So how is your preparation going on for the various examinations like IBPS clerk, mains examination, Canara Bank, PGDBF, Bank of Baroda, PGDBF, right? We also have this NICL AO examination also. So let's move on. That's very good afternoon. Let's wait for one more minute so that some more people will join us from the first onwards. I'll be fast in the session. So please bear with me. I'll give you five seconds for each question. Okay, moving on to the first question of the day for the month of November 2018 current affairs. So please be active in answering the questions. Here is the first question. Who is the present Lok Sabha Secretary General who has received one year extension in the month of November 2018? So who is the present Lok Sabha Secretary General who has received the one year extension? What is the right answer? The right answer is Snehalata Srivatsava. She has received the one year extension as the Lok Sabha Secretary General appointed by the Lok Sabha Speaker. Moving on to the next questions. Simon Biles, who has become the first ever gymnast to win 13 World Championship gold medals, is from which country? Simon Biles. She is a first ever gymnast to win 13 World Championships gold medals. We have Deepa Karmakar, right? Our famous gymnast. So she belongs to USA is the right answer. She has won 13 world championship gold medals. Moving on to the next question. Which city has stopped the Ola Mobility Institute's ease of moving index 2018 in public transport? We have to deal around 200 MCQs. So please be fast in answering the questions. Take only 5 seconds. What is the right answer? Kolkata is the right answer. Kolkata has become the top in stay uh, city in the ease of moving index by the Ola Mobility Institute. Name the head of the three member interministerial committee constituted by Odisha government to address issues raised by farmers recently by the Odisha government to address the farmers issues. So what is the right answer? The right answer is Shashi Bhushan Behera. He was appointed as the interministerial committee head to deal with farmers issues in Odisha. Who was awarded Global Education Award by Malabar Gold and Diamonds in Dubai recently in November? It is Anand Kumar of Super 30, the famous uh, educationist who trains 30 people from poor backgrounds to enter into famous IITs. Right? Who was named the chairperson of electric car pioneer Tesla replacing Elon Musk recently? Electric car pioneer Tesla replacing Elon Musk recently. So it is Robin Denholm. She was appointed as the new pioneer of Tesla replacing Elon Musk. Next. Who has become the first batsman to score four T20 international centuries on 6th November 2018? First batsman to score four T20 internationals. Who is it? It is Rohit Sharma, he has scored four T20s in international century, international ODIs, T20s. Eighth Asian Shotgun and Eleventh Asian Air Gun Championships were held in. So where were they held? They were held in Kuwait. Uttarakhand has celebrated its Foundation Day on. Uttarakhand, Uttarakhand, Charkhand and Chhattisgarh. These states were carved in 2000, right? Uttarakhand from UP, 
झारखंड फ्रॉम बिहार एंड छत्तीसगढ़ फ्रॉम मध्य प्रदेश दीज वेर कार्ड इन द इयर 2000 एंड उत्तराखंड सेलिब्रेट्स इट्स फाउंडेशन डे ऑन नाइन्थ नवंबर Moving on to the next question, which country will have the largest number of people in the world of college going age by 2030 as per UK India Business Council report? So which country will be having the highest number of people in the world of college going age by 2030? Obviously it is India. Next, which country has unveiled the Unmanned aerial vehicle CH7, its new generation stealth combat unmanned aerial vehicle. Yes, as the name says CH, CH stands for China. CH7 belongs to China, it is unmanned aerial vehicle of China. Next. Which country has unveiled a replica of its first permanently crewed space station which will replace the International Space Station, ISS? So which country has unveiled a replica or a prototype of permanently crewed space station which re will replace ISS? It is, again China has launched this. Next. What is the name of hot air ballooning expedition conducted by Indian Army recently? Hot air ballooning expedition. Yes, it is Jai Bharat. This was the hot air ballooning expedition conducted by Indian Army. Next. Which state has launched a technology driven and citizen friendly more bus service? I think you remember Mo Hero campaign, Mo Bus Service, all these are related to Odisha State by Navin Patnayak. Okay. Election Commission has set up Sangwari polling booths in various constituencies of Dash to encourage women voters recently. Recently, for the five states, elections were held, right? So what is the right answer? It was in Chhattisgarh. The Sangwari polling, women polling booths were kept. Okay. Next, Kun Ho Memorial was recently inaugurated by South Korean First Lady Kim Jong Suk and UPCM Yogi Adityanath in which of the following places? Kun Ho Memorial. So where was it inaug inaugurated? It was inaugurated in Ayodhya. Okay. Recently, Faizabad was renamed to Ayodhya or not? And Allahabad to Prayagraj. Next. Which district was renamed as Ayodhya by UPCM Yogi Aditya? Just now I have told you what is the name of it. Faizabad was renamed to Ayodhya and Allahabad to Prayagraj. Okay. National Cancer Awareness Day is observed on. National Cancer Awareness Day is observed on. Yes, when is it observed? It is observed on November 7th. Okay, World Cancer Day is observed on Feb 4th. Okay, we can, I can was a theme actually for 2018 for World Cancer Day. Okay. As per RBA recent decision, external commercial borrowings in the infrastructure space raised by eligible borrowers has been reduced to dash years from earlier five years. 
so ecb stands for external commercial borrowings the companies borrow from private companies of india borrow from other foreign countries even uh, public sector undertakings also borrow okay so it was reduced to 3 years is the right answer next which company has received india's first letter of credit payment via blockchain which company has received india's first letter of credit payment via blockchain it is reliance industries reliance industries has received india's first letter of credit of blockchain you know right blockchain is a technology the emerging technology which is very safe to use and reliance industries has received india's first loc payment via blockchain done by which of the following banks is the question so RIL has received this from which of the following banks? Yes, it is HSBC. HSBC has done this transaction for Reliance Industries. Who has been selected for VR Krishna Air Award 2018? We are Krishna Air Award 2018. Yes, it was Kesavananda Bharati, the famous uh, basic structure doctrine. I think the SSC people might be knowing of Indian Constitution. Some of the features of Indian Constitution come under basic structure, they cannot be amended. The famous Kesavananda Bharati case is very famous okay so he has received this vr krishna air award 2018 india's first nuclear ballistic missile submarine is recently it was conducted the successful test so which is that it is ins arihant ins arihant is a ins calvary is scorpion class submarine okay but it is run by diesel but nuclear powered is ins arihant okay the theme of 2018 national ayurveda day is national ayurveda day is observed every year on uh, dante ras This year for 2018 it was observed on 5th November 2018. So what was the theme? Who is the minister for Ayush? It is Shripad Yeso Nayak, right? And what is the theme of National Ayurveda Day? It is Ayurveda for Public Health. Which municipal corporation has introduced electricity water bills payment with smiley fridge magnets? Smiley fridge magnets. So it was introduced by the New Delhi Municipal Corporation so that the payments can be done through the QR code. QR code means quick response code present on the fridge magnets okay so we can pay through those fridge magnets by scanning the qr code okay how much profit was posted by spi for second quarter that is for july to september 2018 how much profit did sbi post yes it is 945 crores is the profit for Q2 of SPI, which is headquartered at Mumbai. Rajnish Kumar is the chairman. Gaddam Dharmendra was appointed as India's ambassador to Dash. So he was appointed to India's ambassador to Iran. Its capital is Tehran. 
and its currency is real. Next, who has been bestowed with Federation of International Hockey Presidents Award recently? Yes, I think you can easily guess where is the World Cup going on. It is in Odisha, Navin Patnaik, the 2018 Men's Hockey World Cup is going on in Odisha or not? What is the mascot for this? Oli. And the song is Jai Hind India composed by Air Rahman and Gulzar. Lyrics by Gulzar. Okay. Next. Who has been awarded with prestigious Raja Ramon Roy Award presented by the Press Council of India PCI? Who has been awarded with prestigious Raja Ramon Roy Award? It is N. Ram of the Hindu group, right? The Hindu magazine he was awarded with Raja Ramon Roy award which nation has clinched FIBA under 18 women's Asian Cup for the 16th time the basketball tournament it was clinched by China China is the right answer under 18 FIBA which was held at Bengaluru in November okay Securities and Exchange Board of India has cut the listing time for an IPO to dash days from six days at present on 1st November 2018 SEBI our capital market regulator which is headquartered at Mumbai was established in 1988 and made statutory through SEBI Act of 1992 so it has cut the listing time from six days to three days next Indo-French conclave was held in yes Ajay Tyagi is the MD and CEO Indo-French conclave was held in, yes it was held in Nagpur of Maharashtra. So categorize the events, New Delhi and others so that it will be easy for you to recollect before the examination. Where was the 18th Indian Ocean Rim Association of Ministers meeting held? Indian Ocean Rim Association is a grouping of Indian Ocean countries, the countries which touch the Indian Ocean particularly it is headquartered in Eben of Mauritius so it was held in Durban of South Africa next the IRA be the legacy internship program was announced at the end of 18th IORA meeting in Durban to honor which of the following leaders? Is it Mahatma Gandhi, Nelson Mandela, Jawaharlal Nehru, Martin Luther King or none of these? So it is Nelson Mandela. We celebrate Nelson Mandela Day on July 18th, right? He is the Bharat Ratna awardee from India as well as Nobel Peace Prize. Where was the two-day Gyan Kumbh inaugurated by the President Ramnath Kovind on 3rd November 2018? Gyan Kumbh. Yes, it was inaugurated at Haridwar of Uttarakhand. Who has won the Sarlolux Open Badminton Tournament 2018 which was held in Germany?
yes it was won by Shubankar Day has won this Sarlo Lux Open Badminton Tournament 2018. Who has won the Paris Masters title 2018? Paris Masters title of tennis. Yes, it was won by Karen Kachno versus Novak Djokovic. So Karan Kachno has won this Paris Masters title held at Paris. World Tsunami Awareness Day is observed on. World Tsunami Awareness Day. We were hit by tsunami in 2004, right? So when is it observed? It is observed on November 5th. We have tsunami early warning system at Hyderabad in India. At a National Remote Sensing Center, Hyderabad. Turga Pumped Storage Project is in news recently. It is in the state of Turga Pumped Storage Project. Recently, a MOU was signed. So, it is in the state of West Bengal. India and Japan has signed Dash Crore Rupees Loan Agreement for the construction of Turga Pumped Storage Project in West Bengal. So, Turga Storage Project is in West Bengal and the agreement was signed between India and Japan and how much is the amount? 1817 crores was the amount signed for this project. Next. Who has been appointed as a CEO of Swadhar Finserv, a wholly owned subsidiary of RBL Bank? Swadhar Finserv, it is a wholly owned subsidiary of RBL Bank or Ratnakar Bank Limited. It is headquartered in Mumbai. Recently it has launched Jena Bankable Card, yes or no? No, no. Not Jena Bankable Card. Umid Thousand Cyclothon. This was organized by RBL Bank itself. Okay, it is a corporate social responsibility initiative of RBL Bank. It is Vikas Muto. Was appointed as CEO of Swadar Finserv. Next. Former India under-19 player Saurabh Netral was appointed as the captain of Dash cricket team. Saurabh Netralkar was appointed as the captain of USA is the right answer. Next. What is the theme of 2018 World Pneumonia Day? World Pneumonia Day. It is observed on 12th November, World Pneumonia Day. It is stop pneumonia invest in child health is the theme okay next the Himalayan State Regional Council HSRC was recently set up by Niti Aayog which will be chaired by HSRC set up by Niti Aayog so it will be chaired by whom it is VK Saraswat he is a full-time member of Niti Aayog VK Saraswat will be chairing this HRC, HSRC Justice Sanjay Kumar Seth has been sworn as the 24th Chief Justice of Madhya Pradesh High Court so which of the following cities is a principal seat of Madhya Pradesh High Court So, 
we have 24 high courts india has 24 high courts in india lakshadweep comes under kerala high court andaman and nicobar comes under uh, kolkata high court what is the principal seat of where is the principal seat of madhya pradesh high court it is in jabalpur of madhya pradesh that's why this question is given generally people think that it is in bhopal but it is in jabalpur of madhya pradesh which of the following international personalities will be chief guest at 2019 republic day parade of india it is cyril ramphosa of south africa South Africa has many capitals, Johannesburg, Bridgetown, etc. Its currency is Rand, South African Rand. RBI has imposed fine of dash crore each on Dutch Bank and Jammu Kashmir Bank for non-compliance of various norms including asset classification and know your customer norms. Dutch Bank, it is headquartered in Frankfurt of Germany. Okay, 3 crores fine each on Dutch bank as well as Jammu and Kashmir bank. Jammu and Kashmir bank is in Srinagar. Next, when is National Press Day observed in India? National Press Day. So when is it observed? It is observed on November 16th, National Press Day. Non-Crem Dance Festival is related to the state of Non-Crem Dance Festival. It is related to the state of Meghalaya. Next. Who has been appointed as the new Brexit Secretary by UK PM Theresa May? Brexit means Britain exit from the EU. European Union which is headquartered at Brussels of Belgium presently it has 28 nations still UK has not formally exited and out of which 19 use euro euro as their currency so who was appointed it is Stephen Barclay was appointed as a new Brexit secretary next ninth annual defense and security dialogue of India and China was held in Ninth annual defense and security dialogue of India and China was held in Beijing of China. India's first specialized hospital for elephants was opened in India's first dog park was opened in Hyderabad. Yes or no? And hospital for elephants. was opened in Mathura of Uttar Pradesh. Next. Two-day South Asian Regional Conference on Urban Infrastructure was held in. Where was it held? Was held in New Delhi. So categorize the events so that it will be better for you before the examination. New Delhi others write the events name so that it will be easy for you recall once before the exam which of the following has launched next credit card the first interactive credit card in india with buttons next credit card it was launched by the indus in bank which is based in mumbai Okay, it has also launched a single debit cum credit card also. Hope you remember this. Next. When is International Day of Tolerance observed worldwide? National Day of Tolerance. It is observed worldwide November 16th. 
value of indas india's october 2018 trade deficit is trade deficit means imports are more than exports trade surplus means exports are more than imports right so it is 17.13 billion us dollars for october 2018 is the trade deficit total trade deficit not only current account but also capital account which of the following has launched e-learning site nipun e-learning site nipun it was launched by the delhi police e-learning site nipun the 15 day adi mahotsav tribal festival was started in or was held in it was started in our national capital new delhi is the right answer india's international cherry blossom festival was started in cherry blossom festival it is related to meghalaya okay we also have seen nongkrem dance yes or no it's also related to meghalaya Sambat 2018 is a pan India dash conclave which began in Jamshedpur Jharkhand Yes it is tribal conclave Adi Mahotsav is also tribal conclave Export Import Bank of India that is Exim Bank has approved dash line of credit to Suriname for infra network exim bank it was established in the year 1982 through exim bank act of 1981 same like nabard okay and it is headquartered at mumbai and how much amount was signed it is 30.8 million note down the statistics related at once for all the six or seven months Formula 1 H2O World Championship 2018 that is boat racing tourney was organized in It is was organized in Vijayawada of Andhra Pradesh in the Krishna River With the win of his third International Billiard Sport Federation Billiards Crown at Yangon, Myanmar. Pankaj Adwani has become world champion for dash time. IBSF Billiards Crown. So he has become the world champion for 20th time. with his recent third ibsf crown jharkhand was carved out from bihar from on i've told you jharkhand chatisgarh and uttarakhand were carved out in 2000 so 2000 where is it second and fifth option but what is the right answer on 15th november 2000 jharkhand was carved out Okay. Just a minute. Yes. Where was the thirty-eighth edition of India International Trade Fair two thousand eighteen held? India International Trade Fair 2018 held in New Delhi which was the best state awarded in the trade category it was Uttarakhand at the India International Trade Fair 2018 it was held in New Delhi who has been appointed as the UNICEF's India's youth ambassador UNICEF United Nations Children Fund which is headquartered at New York 
so who was appointed as unicef india youth ambassador it is our ding express himadas she is from she is also the ambassador of assam state mary com is from from manipur okay gslv mark 3 d2 of isro has successfully launched dash satellite so it has launched the communication satellite gs gsat 29 gslv mark 3 d2 of isro isro chairman is k sivan headquartered at bangalore the fourth edition of intex south asia the largest international textile sourcing show in south asia was inaugurated on 14 november in dash yes it was inaugurated in colombo of sri lanka west bengal government has observed rasagulla day on dash to mark first anniversary of obtaining the geographical indication tag or gi tag so rasagulla is the gi tag of west bengal it was observed on 14th november next recently ashok chawla has resigned as the chairman of dash bank ashok chawla for the yes bank it is headquartered in mumbai it is a private sector bank what is the rate of wholesale inflation for october 2018 wholesale inflation or wholesale price index its base year is 2011 12 so with this year we compare the current year prices and check whether the prices have risen or not it is 5.28% note down the wholesale inflation and the retail inflation for the months like october September, November, like that for all six, seven months. Mostly they will not ask you, but be prepared. Where was UNICEF's Atal Tinkering Lab 72-hour hackathon inaugurated? UNICEF's Atal Tinkering Labs. Atal Tinkering Labs are established by Niti Aayog to foster innovations in the schools. it is new delhi is the right answer where was wipo conference on the global digital content market 2018 held wipo stands for world intellectual property organization it is headquartered at geneva of switzerland okay it was held in new delhi again next who was assigned with additional charge of ministry of parliamentary affairs after the death of anand kumar anand kumar has died he was a minister for parliamentary affairs as well as chemicals and fertilizers so who was given the additional charge of parliamentary affairs it is narendra singh tomar he is a minister for mines rural development or panchayat raj etc now he is also given with parliamentary affairs okay next who was given the additional charge of ministry of chemicals and fertilizers it was given to sadananda gowda okay he is presently the minister for statistics and program implementation and also the minister for chemicals and fertilizers Twitter India recently launched a new initiative titled Dash aimed at encouraging the youth to contribute in public debates and participate in civic engagement for the 2019 general elections. Yes, it is Power of 18. Power of 18 is the right answer. Which country has been named the safest country to visit as per report by which travel a travel magazine the safest country to visit
it is Iceland. Iceland is the safest country to visit as per the witch travel magazine. When is World Diabetes Day observed? Very important question. World Diabetes Day. Diabetes is caused because of the less insulin production by the pancreas. So it is observed on November 14th, World Diabetes Day. And what was the theme of World Diabetes Day? The family and the diabetes. Next. Which of the following has revoked highest honor Ambassador of Conscience Award to Myanmar leader Aung San Suu Kyi? So it is Amnesty International which is headquartered at London. Okay, so it has taken away this award given to Myanmar leader Aung San Suu Kyi regarding Rohingyas in Myanmar. Okay, they were forced to leave Myanmar. Stan Lee has died in Los Angeles, USA recently. He was a dash. Stan Lee, the famous comic writer regarding the Spider-Man, Batman, etc. For the famous company Marvel. Next, India has increased its financial contribution to United Nations Relief and Works Agency from $1 million in 2016 to Dash dollars in 2018. Yes, how much? It was increased to 5 million US dollars. Next. World Antibiotic Awareness Week is observed on Dash throughout the world. Somebody asked how to crack Canara Bank PO. Okay, you have to study for general awareness, you have to study 6 to 7 months, particularly current affairs as well as the static GK. Be updated with the current affairs mostly because 70 to 80 percentage questions will be from current affairs itself. So World Antibiotic Awareness Week was observed between November 12th to 18th, 2018. Where was Global Cooling Innovation Summit held between 12th to 13th November? Global Cooling Innovation Summit was held in New Delhi. Where was Who was announced as the winner of Munin Barkotaki Literary Award 2018 in Assam recently? Munin Barkotaki Literary Award was given to Debosan Bora for his contribution to literature in Assam. Name the world's largest supercomputer designed to work like the human brain that has been switched on for the first time. It is spin hacker, but what is the full form of spin hacker? Spiking neural network architecture. This is the full form. Is the world's largest supercomputer to work like human brain. That is, it was switched on for the first time. Who has won the men's singles title of 2018 Fuzhou China Open Badminton Tournament? Who has won this? It is Kento Momata of Japan. Next. Indo India Indonesia Navy bilateral exercise is named as India Indonesia Navy bilateral exercise. It is 
Samudra Shakti is the right answer and the military exercise is Karuda Shakti. Samudra Maitri was the operation by India in Indonesia who were uh, regarding tsunami related event which was caused in Indonesia. Okay. So, Samudra Shakti is the right answer. It is a Navi bilateral exercise and military is Garuda Shakti. Samudra Maitri is operation. PNB Housing Finance has obtained refinance sanction of how much rupees crore from National Housing Bank. National Housing Bank is a 100% subsidiary of NABARD, sorry, RBI, which is headquartered at New Delhi, N for N, New Delhi. Okay. It provides credit for the housing in India. 3,500 crores. Next. What is the retail inflation for October 2018? How much was wholesale inflation? 5.28% and retail inflation is 3.31% for October 2018. PM Modi has inaugurated first multimodal terminal constructed on River Dash. So between Varnasi to Haldia. This is the first multimodal terminal. The PepsiCo has transferred some of its cargo. And the second one was Kolkata to Patna. Recently it was taken as the second one, second multimodal terminal. It is on the Ganges River. Okay, on the National Waterway 1, International Symposium to Promote Innovation and Research in Energy Efficiency Inspire 2018 kicked off in DASH, which was organized by EESL and World Bank. So it was organized in New Delhi is the right answer in Spy 2018. Where was two day international conference on yoga health? We have international day of yoga on 21st June. For 2018 yoga for peace was the theme right? It was held at Dehradun 2018. And International two-day conference was held in Goa recently. November. India uh, Indian Army has decided to observe which year as the year of disabled soldiers. Yes, 2018 as the year of disabled soldiers by Indian Army. Okay. The chief of Indian Army is Bipin Rawat. Name the authors of the book Healed that was unveiled recently. Healed. It was written by Manisha Koirala, the famous Bollywood actress and Neelam Kumar. Who was appointed as a chairperson of Competition Commission of India which checks into the un Malpractices into the competition of various companies. Okay, CCA Act 2002, it was established in New Delhi. Okay, Ashok Kumar Gupta was appointed as the CCI chairperson. Like Satish Kumar Gupta for Paytm payments bank okay who was conferred with france highest civilian honor knight of the legion of honor recently knight of the legion of honor to jawahar lal sarin he was given this france highest civilian honor which country has unveiled the world's first artificial intelligence anchor news anchor It is China, China, the Xinhua News Agency. 
has unveiled this. Next. Where was the fifth World Internet Conference held? Fifth World Internet Conference. It was held in Fujian of China is the right answer. Padur Strategic Petroleum Reserve is in the state of recently government has given approval for this Padur Strategic Petroleum Reserve so that the petroleum will be stored in that reserve. Okay. The Rocky Mountains in Karnataka. Padur Strategic Petroleum Reserve is in Karnataka is the right answer. When is National Education Day is observed in India? National Education Day. National Education Day is observed on November 11th is the right answer. Okay, to honor Maulana Abul Kalam Azad, the Frontier Gandhi birthday. Next. Where was Northeast first water handloom hut inaugurated? Water handloom hut, it was inaugurated in Manipur. The famous Loktak Lake, Kemul, Kebul Lamjao National Park are in Manipur only. And Maricom is also from Manipur. Which state election commission has made its mandatory of having a usable toilet and a two-child norm for all aspiring candidates of the upcoming panchayat polls. So which state election commission? It is Assam. So usable toilet as well as two-child norm is compulsory. The Asian Development Bank has approved Dash Million Loan to Energy Efficiency Services Limited to promote energy efficiency use in India. ADB which is having 67 members out of which India is also a member which is headquartered at Mandalayong, Philippines. Okay. 13 million US dollars. Which of the following from India has won UNESCO's Asia Pacific Award for Conservation? UNESCO is headquartered at Paris of France. So which has won this award? It is Ladakh restoration work of Jammu and Kashmir has won this UNESCO's Asia Pacific Award. 33rd ASEAN Summit was held in ASEAN stands for Association of Southeast Asian Nations. which is of 10 members, which is headquartered at Jakarta of Indonesia. India is not a member of ASEAN, but it is a member of East Asia Summit, ASEAN Regional Forum, etc. and RCEP. Okay, but not the member of ASEAN. So where was it held? It was held in Singapore is the right answer for 2018. Kartarpur corridor which was recently approved by Union Cabinet is located in which district of Punjab. So it will be connecting the Pakistan, Punjab with India. Okay, the Kartarpur corridor. Kartarpur is in Pakistan. Okay, and it will connect the Gurdaspur district of Punjab in India. India's first National Institute of Interfaith Studies will be set up in which state? National Institute of Interfaith Studies. So it will be coming up in Punjab, Kartarpur Corridor, Gurdaspur, Punjab and National Institute of Interfaith Studies, Punjab. Who has become the first Indian golfer to win European Tour Sir Henry Cotton Rookie of the Year Award? So it is Shubankar Sharma recently has won the Tour of Merit Award also, right? Shubankar Sharma is Indian golfer. The 14th edition of International Theatre Festival for Children Jashne Bachpan 2018 was started or 
was held in which city? We have November 14th as Children's Day or not, National Children's Day. And Universal Children's Day is on November 20th. It is in New Delhi. It was held in New Delhi, Jashne Bachpan. Which Indian institute has developed a smartphone based system to detect adulteration in milk? Adulteration in milk. So it was developed by IIT Hyderabad. Next. LIC has partnered with which of the following digital payment service provider to offer online insurance premium payments on its platform? Yes, it is by with Paytm. Okay, its headquarters in Noida. Who is the chair chairperson or key person? Vijay Shekhar Sharma. Okay, its parent is 197 Communications. Which organization was selected for the Asia Environmental Enforcement Award 2018 for its contribution in combating the transboundary environmental crime by United Nations Environment Program? It is headquartered in Nairobi of Kenya. At Nairobi, we also have UN Habitat. So it was won by the Wildlife Crime Control Bureau of India. Asia Environmental Enforcement Award. Name the actor who was awarded with the third Sayaji Ratna Award for his social contribution to pay off the loans of several farmers from Uttar Pradesh and Maharashtra. So it is Amitabh Bachchan has paid the loans of several farmers from Uttar Pradesh and Fa Maharashtra and received the third Sayaji Ratna Award. Name the person who has been appointed as the head of WhatsApp India. WhatsApp is of Facebook. So Abhijit Bose was appointed as the head of WhatsApp India. And grievance officer is Klomal Lahari. Hope you remember grievance officer for WhatsApp. Union Cabinet has approved ACROSS scheme that is Atmosphere and Climate Research Modeling Observing Systems and Services with an estimated cost of how much rupees crores? It is 1450 crores for ACROSS scheme. Under the Ministry of Earth Sciences, Harshavardhan is a minister. He is also the minister for Environment, Forest and Climate Change and Minister for Science and Technology. He is from Chandni Chauk, Delhi, Lok Sabha constituency. Which state has topped the list of states with highest employability followed by Rajasthan and Haryana as per the India Skills Report 2019, which is the first state. Second is Rajasthan and third is Haryana. First is Andhra Pradesh in the India Skills Report 2019. Who has been appointed to head the UN Environment Program? I have already told you its headquarters is at Nairobi of Kenya. At Nairobi we also have UN Habitat. That is Joyce Suya. Earlier it was Eric Sholem. He has resigned. Now it is Joyce Suya. Which state has launched month long Nari Sheshakti Karan Sankal Babyan or Women Empowerment Campaign? It is the state of Uttar Pradesh. The world's first underground hotel was opened in which of the following cities?
India's underground museum will be coming up in this was recent current affairs in Puducherry, right? So underground hotel was opened in Shanghai of China. Who has become which has become the first small finance bank to introduce personal loan scheme for salaried individuals through which 50,000 to 15 lakh rupees personal loan will be given for the people who are whose salary is greater than 15,000. So which is that first small finance bank? It is Ujjivan Small Finance Bank is the right answer. It is headquartered at Bengaluru. Okay. These three are in Bengaluru. ESAF is in Trisur. AU is in Jaipur. Trisur of Kerala. Next. Who has been elected the new president of Interpol? Interpol it is the international police which helps the various countries to catch criminals worldwide. It is in Lion of France. So it is the South Korean Kim Jong-un of South Korea was appointed as the new president of Interpol. Who has been appointed as the new Prime Minister of Fiji for another four more years on 20th November 2018? Fiji, its capital is Suva and its currency is a Fijian dollar. It is Borak Baini Marama was appointed as the new Prime Minister of Fiji. Which team has won the 59th edition of Subrato Cup? They may ask you Subrato Cup it is related to football. This was held at Dr. Ambedkar Stadium in New Delhi. Bangladesh Krida Shiksha Protsahan has won this 59th Subrato Cup which is related to football. Who became the first Indian cricketer to touch the 11,000 run figure in the Ranji Trophy against Baroda in Nagpur recently? It is Wasim Jafar. Wasim Jafar has become the first Indian cricketer to touch 11,000 runs in Ranji. World Fisheries Day is observed on. World Fisheries Day. World Fisheries Day is observed on November 21st. Seventh International Tourism Mart was hosted in the state of. Seventh International Tourism Mart was hosted in the state of. Tripura is the right answer. Biplab Dev is a CM. Kaptan Singh Solanki is the governor. Which state has passed the resolution seeking 33% reservation for women in state assembly? 33% reservation. Generally, we have reservation in panchayats, but not in assembly and parliament. But recently, this state has passed. Which is that state? It is Odisha. Naveen Patnaik is a CM and Ganeshi Lal is a governor. What is the name of the portal launched by Andhra Pradesh CM Chandrabhai Maidu in Amaravati to make land records available to people? Yes, it is Budar and Bu Seva, where the portals launched to make the land records online in AP. Name the missile system and the bidding amount which was selected by the Indian Army from Russia. It is Igla S is the name of the missile and this was the low amount for which these missile systems will be brought from Russia by India. 
12th World Congress on Mountain Medicine was held in. 12th World Congress on Mountain Medicine. It was held in the Kathmandu of Nepal. Next. What is the name of world's first total body scanner? It is named as Explorer. Who was appointed as the UNICEF's youngest ever goodwill ambassador on the eve of World Children's Day or Universal Children's Day is observed on 20th November. So who is it? It is Millie Bobby Brown, UNICEF's youngest ever goodwill ambassador. When was the World Hollow Day celebrated? World Hello Day on which Graham Bell has said Hello. It is 21st November. Which of the following organizations has won the 2018 Indira Gandhi Prize for Peace, Disarmament and Development? Indira Gandhi Prize for Peace, Disarmament and Development. It is Center for Science and Environment. Which is run by Sunita Narain, headquartered in New Delhi, a private organization. What is the rank of India in global annual talent ranking released by renowned IMD Business School, Switzerland? It is 53rd position for India. Which state government has signed an MOU with Airbus BizLab as per which an innovation center will be set up for planning and executing all the activities to help the startups? It was signed by the Kerala Tourism or Kerala's sorry, Kerala De State Development Corporation with Airbus BizLab. What was the theme of Universal Children's Day observed on 20th November? Universal Children's Day. We have 14th November as National Children's Day and 20th November as Universal Children's Day. National Teachers Day is on September 5th and World Teachers Day is on exactly one month, October 5th. Okay. Children's are taking over and turning the world blue is the theme of Universal Children's Day observed on 20th November. Where was 49th International Film Festival of India held? It is generally held since 2004 in Goa itself. Every year it will be held in Goa itself. India's first Sri Vishwakarma Skill Development University was inaugurated in Is inaugurated in Palwal of Haryana. Siddharth Rath was appointed as the MD and CEO of Siddharth Rath. MD and CEO of State Bank of Mauritius, SBM. Okay, it is headquartered in Port Louis, the capital city of Mauritius. Which city is a winner of 2018 Most Vegan Friendly City Award given by the People for Ethical Treatment of Animals? PETA India. Yes, Chennai has got this Most Vegan Friendly City given by PETA. Earlier PETA was banning the, it was against the jelly Kattu in Tamil Nadu. Okay. Later, Supreme Court has allowed. World Bank has agreed to lend how much million US dollars to boost Jharkhand power transmission infra. World Bank and IMF are headquartered in Washington DC. It is 310 million US dollars was signed for the Jharkhand's power transmission. Note down all the statistics 
or numbers related current affairs at one place world television day is observed on world television day it is observed on november 21st world hello day and world television day where was the 27th basic that is brazil south africa india and china ministerial meeting on climate change held basic meeting 27th meeting was held in new delhi which of the following state governments has legally banned hookah parlors after gujarat and maharashtra yes it is punjab punjab is facing drug crisis so it has become the third state after gujarat and maharashtra to legally ban hookah parlors which nation has agreed to rejoin commonwealth two years after withdrawing from the 53 nation grouping commonwealth it is a grouping of 53 nations which is secretariat at london and it is maldives maldives capital is malay recently ibrahim mohammed soli was be has become the pm of maldives currency is rufia konichiwa pune first two day indonesh indo japan business council was held in so as the name says business council it is a business festival only konichiwa pune between india and japan nsc has launched online platform and app named dash for retail investors to buy government securities that is gsec it is nsc go bid to sell or buy government securities and uh, rbi does open market operations right to sell or buy government securities vajra prahar 2018 is a joint military exercise between india and usa is the right answer two day asia pacific economic cooperation apex summit was held in apex it is headquartered in singapore for economic cooperation was held in papua new guinea its capital is ports mores by and its currency is kina papua new guinea kina which city is a venue of eighth national conference of women in polis it was held in ranchi of jharkhand ayush ministry has celebrated its first naturopathy day on ayush ayurveda yunani naturopathy siddha homeopathy okay its minister is shripad yaso nayak first naturopathy day was observed on november 18th where was 10th indra 2019 india russia joint military exercise held it was held in jhansi of uttar pradesh avia indra is air force okay air force exercise between india and russia and indra only indra means it is joint military exercise which of the following states has launched cool an online open learning training platform so as it says k k stands for either karnataka or kerala right so which is a most literary state kerala cool Shashakti India Asset Management Company was created under the leadership of Sunil Mehta to resolve NPAs over Dash. 
This question was asked in recent IBPSPO mains exam, Sashakt program. Sunil Mehata is the head of Indian Banks Association also, as well as Punjab National Bank. Rupees 500 crores. Next, who will take over as the new revenue secretary in the Union Home F sorry Finance Ministry? Who is the Finance Secretary now? Earlier it was Asmu Kadia, now A.N. Ja or Ajay Narayan Ja. Now Revenue Secretary is Ajay Bhushan Pandey. Ajay Narayan Jha is Finance Secretary and Ajay Bhushan Pandey is Revenue Secretary. Girish Chandra Murmu is Expenditure Secretary. What was the theme of International Men's Day observed on 19th November? International Men's Day. It is observed on 19th November, positive male role models. On 19th November, we also have World Toilet Day. When nature calls is a theme. Yes, I have told you right. World Toilet Day, November 19th, when nature calls is a theme. So sanitation plays an important role in the health of the all the people around the world. Which world is chosen as Oxford's Dictionary's Word of the Year 2018? Recently Cambridge Dictionary also has come up with nomophobia, yes or no? Excessive use of mobile phones. Or else Akshay Kumar will take away your mobiles, yes or no? Cambridge University, Nomophobia and Oxford Dictionary, Toxic. Toxic for Oxford Dictionary. Ali Padamsi has passed away. He was A or an? He was an ad film maker. He has also the, played the role of Muhammad Ali Jinnah in the famous movie Gandhi. Who has become the ATP Finals 2018 Championship held in London? It was Alexander Zwell. What is the name of Asia's first and world's third woman neurosurgeon who has passed away recently in November? It is T.S. Kanaka. Where was the ninth session of India Kyrgyz Intergovernmental Commission for Trade, Economic, Scientific and Technology Corp Cooperation held? It was held in New Delhi is the right answer. Next. Who has been appointed as the new chairman of Inland Waterways Authority of India? It comes under Ministry of Shipping. It is Jalaj Srivastava. Jal means water or not. So like that you have to remember. India's first ever autism township will come up in which of the following Indian cities? It will be coming up in West Bengal. Which CAPF has joined with Dudwa Tiger Reserve to provide security for its forest. Dudwa Tiger Reserve is in Uttar Pradesh. We also have Pilihibit Tiger Reserve in Uttar Pradesh. It is in Shahastra Seema Bal. It will be guarding this Dudwa Tiger Reserve. Which country has decided to venture into Internet of Things with new satellite system called Marathon? 
it is by russia internet of things means connecting every all the devices to internet is internet of things which country is set to host the 50th union world conference on lung health in 2019 it is by india at hyderabad okay in 2019 union government has launched basha sangam to introduce school students to how many indian languages eighth schedule talks about the indian languages we have 22 official indian languages so 22 languages will be introduced at least some basic like namaskar okay like that of other languages too konkan 2018 the bilateral naval exercise between india and which country has started off at goa recently konkan 2018 as you know konkan coast goa right so it was between india and uk konkan vajrapahar is between india and USA that is military exercise Samudra Shakti is between India and Indonesia who has become the which of the following has become the first Indian state to launch single emergency number 112 connecting police fire health and other helplines so which is that state it is Himachal Pradesh single helpline number 112 who has been selected as a recipient of 2018 Bharat Ratna Pandit Bhimshen Joshi Lifetime Achievement Award for Classical Music? It is Keshav Ginde selected for this award or his classical music contribution. Best State Award at the 38th International Trade Fair. I think I have already discussed this. This trade fair was held in New Delhi and Uttarakhand was given the best state award at the International Trade India International Trade Fair held at New Delhi. Which country has become the first NATO nation to appoint a female chief of armed forces? NATO North Atlantic Treaty Organization which is headquartered at Brussels of Belgium okay we also have EU plus World Customs Organization at Brussels it is a Slovenia Slovenia is the right answer its capital is Ljubljana and its currency is a euro who has written the world's chess champ title of world chess championship defeating Fabiano Cariana at World Chess Championship in London it is again the world champion Magnus Carlsen they may ask you he is from which country it is Norway he belongs to Norway where was a symposium on Gandhi today held on 29 November 2018 Gandhi today it was held at Kathmandu of Nepal which city is a venue of 13th G20 summit G20 is niche grouping of 19 plus European Union it has no headquarters it doesn't have any permanent secretariat G20 and 2022 summit will be held in India 2019 summit will be held at Osaka of Japan okay and 2018 summit was held at Buenos Aires of Argentina best film golden peacock award was uh, was given to which of the following movies at 49th international film festival of India held at Goa so it was Donbas of Ukraine Ukraine's capital is Kiev and its currency is Hain River Name the person who has received the lifetime contribution at IFI 2018 at Goa. 
lifetime contribution to cinema was given to Salim Khan. India's first hyperspectral imaging satellite HISIS, an advanced Earth observation satellite along with 30 foreign satellites were launched through. So HISIS, this is of India, plus 30 foreign satellites were launched through PSLV C43 from the Satish Dhawan Space Center at Nellore in Andhra Pradesh. Niti Aayog has collaborated with Singapore Cooperation Enterprise and Temasek Foundation uh, organized the second phase of urban water management program at India Habitat Center in India Habitat Center if you know where is it you can guess the answer it is at New Delhi so this second phase of urban management program on water recycling and reuse was held at India Habitat Center New Delhi Government of India has conferred National Projects Construction Company Limited NPCC with which status? It was given Mini Ratna Category 1. CSIR Institute of Microbial Technology IMTech or IMTech has partnered with German company Merck to establish high-end skill development center at CSIR IM Tech in which city? So if you know where is CSIR IM Tech, you can easily answer it is in Chandigarh, the Union Territory. First edition of Sustainable Blue Economic Conference was held in. It was held in Nairobi where we have UNEP and UN Habitat. Yes or no? of Kenya, Nairobi of Kenya. Who has been appointed as the new chairman of National Skill Development Corporation, NSDC? Who is the Minister for Skill Development and Entrepreneurship? Dharmendra Pradhan. He is also the Minister for Petroleum and Natural Gas. It is A.M. Nayak of LNT. He is the chairman of LNT, Larson and Tubro. Dash is India's first advanced personal robo for kids that has been developed by graduates of IIT Bombay uh, who are co-founders of startup called Emotix. The personal robo for kids. It is Miko 2. The European Union has set its goal to be climate neutral by climate neutral by 2050 European Union it is a grouping of 28 nations out of which 19 use euro still UK is still the member of Euro European Union which is headquartered at Brussels of Belgium so it wants to become climate neutral by 2050 who has been appointed as the chairman of Union Public Service Commission UPSC till 7th of August 2020. UPSC conducts examinations and recruits people to civil services and other group A services. It is Aravind Saxena was appointed as UPSC chairman till 2020. Name the smart toilet developed by researchers at Massachusetts Institute of Technology and European Space Agency to detect diseases like cancer and diabetes. It is a fit loo is the name of the smart toilet. SBI Echo Wrap has released was released by SBI states that GDP growth in September quarter that is the second quarter is expected to decelerate between 7.5 percentage to dash over the three month period. July to September, this is the second quarter. It is 7.6 percent. Okay. Next. Who has been appointed as a new chairman of Atomic Energy Regulatory Board? 
ఏఈఆర్బి కుంటూరు నాగేశ్వరరావు సతీష్ కుమార్ గుప్తా ఇస్ ఫర్ పేటిఎం పేమెంట్స్ బ్యాంక్ అశోక్ కుమార్ గుప్తా ఇస్ సిసిఐ గుంటూరు నాగేశ్వరరావు ఇస్ ఫర్ ఏఈఆర్బి మన్నేం నాగేశ్వరరావు ఇస్ ఫర్ సిబిఐ డైరెక్టర్ Government of India and Asian Development Bank has signed how much million loan dollars to improve urban services in four Karnataka towns. So, 75 million US dollars was signed between Government of India and ADP. Who has been appointed as the new Chief Electoral Officer of Delhi? It is Ranbir Singh. Vijay Kumar Dev is the Chief Secretary of Delhi. Who has named the Indian cricketer who has been named captain of ICC Women's World T20 11? It is Harman Preet Kaur of India for cricket team. Who has won the Davis Cup of Tennis 2018? Croatia. Croatia's capital is Zagreb. Zagreb and currency is Kuna. Who are, which team has won the Federation of International Hockey Women's Championship Trophy 2018 held at Wujin, China? It was won by Netherlands. Its capital is Amsterdam and its currency is Euro. Alka Mittal has become the first woman director on Dashboard. She has become the first woman director on Oil and Natural Gas Corporation Board. Which state government has come out with lexicon of 21 rare tribal languages vanish to preserve vanishing native languages in state? So 22 languages is of Basha Sangam. 22 is the official uh, language number which is mentioned in 8th schedule of Indian constitution, 21 is by Odisha, to rare tribal languages, to preserve this, 21 rare tribal languages. Raksha Mantri Nirmala Sita Raman has launched Mission Raksha Gyan Shakti at, she has launched at New Delhi. What is the name of Kailash Satyati's award-winning YouTube documentary released on November 27, 2018? He is the Nobel Peace Prize winner. The name of the YouTube documentary is The Price of Free. Yes, Saurabh Yadav, Kanara Bank Me Current Affair Aayega. You have to learn 6 to 7 months current affairs. Which nation has recorded highest re average real wage growth? as per global wage report ILO global wage report is published by ILO which is headquartered at Geneva of Switzerland so India has stopped this highest average real wage growth from 2018 to 17 the Bengal Green University will be soon renamed as Rani Rashmoni Green University Rani Rashmoni was the founder of which temple in Kolkata Rani Rashmoni was the founder of Dakshineshwar Kali Temple. All of these are in West Bengal only. But Dakshineshwar Kali Temple was built by Rani Rashmoni. Which state has stopped in implementing Ayushman Bharat after two months of Ayushman Bharat implementation? That is Pradhan Mantri Jan Arogya Yojana, which provides 5 lakhs medical cover for secondary and tertiary health care. To around 10 crore families, so that 50 crore people will be benefited in India. So it is Gujarat which has stopped this. National Festival for Children of Child Care Institutions, House Law 2018 was held in. It was held in New Delhi. 
where was a 70 feet tall statue of Lord Buddha, the second tallest of Buddha in India unveiled. The first is Basaveshwara statue in uh, Karnataka, that is the tallest statue in India. I'm sorry. Okay. In Rajgir of Bihar, the second tallest Buddha of India in India was unveiled. Who has been appointed as a new Chief Election Commission of India? Who has who will take the seat from 2nd December 2018? It is Sunil Arora. Earlier it was Om Prakash Rawat. Now this Chief Election Commissioner of India is Sunil Arora. Government of India and ADB have signed how much million dollar pact to upgrade state highways in Bihar? IBPS clerk के लिए 6 to 7 months current affairs पढ़ना चाहिए, ठीक है? 200 million dollar loan was signed. Who has won the Abu Dhabi Grand Prix 2018? It is Lewis Hamilton has won the Abu Dhabi Grand Prix 2018. India's National Milk Day, the father of white revolution who is it Varji's Koreans birthday he is backbone behind the Amul it is observed on November 26th so what is the name of the portal launched for, which is a centralized electronic platform for processing interest subvention on bank loans under Deen Dayal Antyodaya Yojana National Urban Livelihoods Mission it is Paisa, is a portal named. What is the name of India's first smartphone for kids which was launched recently? Robo for kids is Miko2, smartphone for kids is Star by Easy Phone. Which of the following cities is the venue of first ever India-Russia strategic economic dialogue? It was held in St. Petersburg of Russia. Who has won the women singles in Syed Modi International Championships? It was won by Han Hui. And men's singles was won by Samir Varma. Five day exhibition on our vote, our future, inaugurated on 26th November at, at Hyderabad. Rhymes, regional integrated multi hazard early warning system, has termed the dash cyclone which hit the coast of Odisha as the rarest of rare. It is Titli cyclone on Odisha was declared as the rarest of rare by Rhymes. Dash Jolly Grand Airport would be renamed after Adal Bihari Vajpayee. It is Uttarakhand's Jolly Grand Airport will be renamed after Adal Bihari Vajpayee. Which of the following nations has clinched ICC Women's World T20 title in cricket? It is Australia versus England. Australia has won this for Women's World T20. Mary Comb has the, become the first female boxer to win dash gold medals at world championships. Six gold medals. She is the first boxer to win six gold medals at world championships. In which state does Jiri Mela festival celebrated? Jiri Mela festival is celebrated in Jammu and Kashmir. Jangal Mahal festival is observed in West Bengal. And Bali Yatra festival is observed in Odisha. So these days one or two festivals are asked in the exam. International Day of Elimination of Violence Against Women is observed on November 25th. Men singles in Syed Modi International Championship, Samir Varma. Newman single Han Hui. Okay.
Which of the following cities was selected to participate in Global Sustainable Cities 2025 initiative? So it is Noida and Greater Noida from Uttar Pradesh has become uh, was selected to participate in Global Sustainable Cities 2025 initiative. When is Indian Con Constitution Day observed? 26 now sorry. 26 November 1949 Indian Constitution was adopted. On 26 November 1950 it was it has come into force. Bhavani Devi becomes first Indian to win a gold medal in Senior Commonwealth Dash Championship in Canberra. So she belongs to fencing. Ministry of Finance has approved the enhancement of total outlay of first phase of the scheme from this is fame scheme okay fast adoption of and manufacturing of electric and hybrid vehicles that is a fame scheme so it is 895 crores is the right answer okay so successfully we have completed around 220 plus questions So did you enjoy the session? Yes, thumbs up. So all the best for your examination. Uh, be always confident in your preparation. Practice as many mock tests as possible. So take very good care of yourself. I'll meet you next time. How much did you score in this? Please let me know too. So thank you. I'll meet next time. Take very good care of yourself. Bye.